Hi, I'm Tiffany from Entree Training and Development and it's a great pleasure today to be meeting to introduce Christy to you for our Meet the Facilitator series. Christy is all about health and wellbeing. Hi Christy. Hi Tiffany. So Christy, please could you let the viewers know why is health and wellness so important in the workplace? Sure. Well I find that um, with the 10 or so years experience I've had with personal training and holistic coaching that health and wellbeing in the workplace is so important primarily for resilience is the, one of the biggest things and studies have really proven that. Um, also just in stress management as well uh, and having a release. So uh, in the workplace it's an area where um, as I know through my corporate background as well, having to uh, deal with things in a certain way that's acceptable within the workplace. So having an outlet to uh, whether it's physical exercise or it's yoga or it's uh, meditation, just something outside of the workplace to be able to funnel the th uh, that energy that maybe you wouldn't be able to normally release in a work environment is really important. Also the, from the perspective of team bonding, Yes. It's really good as well. Um, so if it's something where everyone can get together and share something, shared experience is so important and it really helps with staff morale. Mm -hmm. uh, then I would say the other part is from the management perspective of, the, of management being able to provide um, a service or a, an environment where the staff feel encouraged and supported to do things. So say for instance at lunchtime it's okay to go out and do something at lunchtime. Mm -hmm. It might be a workout or it might be doing yoga or meditation or something like that where they don't feel like they're going to be at a disadvantage. Yeah. Um, I do a lot of stuff with clients who at the, in their lunch times, they come out and do outdoor sessions with me, and they find that that's a really good stress relief. Also, just getting some sunlight, getting some yes, air on the yeah. skin, having a laugh. Like, yeah. and it doesn't always have to be about doing million burpees. It can just be about uh, generating energy inside the body rather yes. than reverting to chocolate <laughs> at three o'clock. Yes, because a million burpees does not sound like fun to me. No, <laughs> no, no, no. But I also see, you know, I'm talking to more and more clients these days and they're saying how important it is to be bringing that health and wellness into the workplace mm. uh, and also nutrition. And I know that nutrition is another area that you also provide workshops on. Um, mm. Just very quick, easy um, breakfast, lunches or dinners that people can be doing in the workplace and I think that's really important too. And what about, what, what can you leave with our viewers today as a top tip? Uh, well, my top tip today might sound a bit controversial, but it's, well, I call it the green zone. The more you can get in the green zone, which is when your body's relaxed, that's when your body will want to burn fat. It will allow you to burn fat. So um, often people will think, I need to work harder, train harder, eat less, um, not eat any carbs, all those sorts of things in order to lose body fat because most people say they want to lose body fat, but actually when your body will allow you to do that is when you're in a relaxed state. So maybe it's changing it up, yeah. maybe go for walks instead and uh, get more sleep. And then once you're feeling less stressed, you can move that. Perfect. Cool. So if you're interested in having Christy come to your workplace to do some training and development, please give Entree Training and Development a call. She's able to help you out with nutrition, health and wellness and body. Thank you. Thanks, Christy. Thanks, Tiffany.